Welcome. Uh, what I wanted to do today is show you how to simplify uh, 10 minus 2 in parentheses divided by 2. Now, there's one thing we want to remember. Whenever we see parentheses, and you know, I'll talk a little bit more about order of operations, but it's really important that we understand that we follow the rules of order of operations. And one of the things that order of operations tells us to do is always do what's inside of your parentheses or your grouping symbols first. That's kind of like your directions. Hey, here's the grouping symbols. Do that first. Do whatever operations are inside of that first. So inside my parentheses, I'm not going to worry about the division right now. Inside my parentheses, it's going to have 10 divided or 10 subtract 2. So that's simply all I'm going to make sure I do for this problem. 10 subtract 2 is going to leave me 8 divided by 2. Now, um, the only other operation I can do is I do 8 divided by 2, which is going to leave me 4. Now, one thing I just want to show you is why do we, you know, why did I have to do uh, parentheses first? Well, because that is the answer I wanted to get. If I wanted to get a different answer or multiple different answers, you know, we wouldn't have those rules, right? Everybody hates rules. But let me just kind of explain what if I put the parentheses around my other two numbers? Let's just say I did 2 divided by 2. Well, if I was to follow and I was going to put my parentheses inside of there, I'd have 10 minus 2 divided by 2 is 1, so I'd have 10 minus 1 equals 9. So obviously 9 and 4 are not the same answer. So it's very important for us to follow the rules given. And the rules simply stated for this problem is whenever you see parentheses, make sure you follow that operation first. Then, or I'm sorry, follow simplifying inside the parentheses first by whatever operations you need. Then we'll continue on with the rest of the problem. So that's how I do that one. Thanks.